Hi guys, it's Lisa. I am here to do a layout for March 30th through April 5th and I have all my pictures uh, ready to go. That picture there I'm just showing you because I think it's adorable of Polly. Um, she, we came in the living room and she was actually sitting on the couch with her feet on the hassock. So it was kind of funny. And I'm using my Scraptastic April kit, which I just got um, when I was making this layout. So I love the colors. And this layout, I decided to uh, do basically yellow and a teal color just because of the cards that I chose and also some of the embellishments that came in the kit. I really wanted to use that teal colored bow. And also, um, there was a couple of little teal colored uh, there. Are, um, little embellishments. There's an umbrella um, and a star and then also the, some of the cards that I chose uh, were yellow. So that is a wood veneer that came with our kit. We got probably six of them with different um, like smiley face, uh, sad face, and uh, that's actually a, <laughs> a face that's crying because on April 5th we had a snowstorm. We woke up in I mean, it wasn't a huge snowstorm, but there was probably six inches of snow, so we had to get the snowblower out, and we had already packed everything away. So um, that picture on the lower right, <clears throat> excuse me, is Polly uh, in the snowstorm, and uh, I don't think she was too impressed about that. But I did my journaling on um, the computer and then printed it out on the photo paper. So I, I like to do that sometimes so I can get all my journaling done in a different font, whatever font I feel like doing that day, which I like to do. And then this card that I'm working on here, I just printed this little saying off Facebook or something. It says, um, it's a little sun and it says, um, let your soul shine. Um, the one that I just picked up was actually a screenshot of uh, email that my husband got saying he made the Dean's List again. So he's just finishing up uh, one of his degrees in psychology and uh, he has been on the Dean's List now for two years. So um, between, um, sorry you can hear my dog coughing. We just got back from vacation. She ended up with kennel cough even though she had her vaccines and everything. So that's kind of a bummer. But anyways, back to what I was talking about. Yeah, so he's, his GPA is like, I don't know, almost 4.0. So between working a ton of hours, overnight shifts and stuff like that, um, he has been able to uh, manage homework, um, you know, being a husband and going to school full time. So he's pretty amazing. And then um, that little, those little stars are like uh, vellum. So I went ahead and adhered those down with uh, my little mini attacher. And then that little um, bubble there, um, I'm going to go ahead and put, I don't think I did that yet. No, I didn't. Anyways, um, I have another picture there that I did in black and white. Sometimes I like to do black and white to kind of, um, I don't know, mix up my layout a little bit. And I like to do um, some color, some black and white. And right now I'm just putting on these little um, flare badges that we got with our kit, which are adorable. And that one has yellow in it also. So I kind of have like a yellow, teal, and black theme going on. Um, let's see. These must be, I'm looking for, I think I was looking, oh, these are amazing. They're, they're like stickers that can go on your photos. You can put them on your photos and you can also put them on anything like paper. But they're by Simple Stories and they are called, they came in our kit, DIY um, Simple Stories uh, Clear Stickers. And I really liked them. Um, you'll see I used them a couple of times. Sorry, my dog's coughing again. Poor thing. Uh, let's see, that bow is adorable, and then that little sticker says seriously, which is uh, kind of goes along with the photo of Polly uh, looking through the window after she went out in the morning and realized there was six inches of snow on the ground, and like I said, she wasn't impressed, so I had to get a photo of that. Uh, she's basically saying, let me in, I'm freezing, and I'm like, let me get my camera, so poor dog. <laughs> uh, so I put that on there. 
and then I um, there's like four pages of stickers in this um, simple stories pack which I love I mean there's just so many different sayings and like I said they can stick to photos so I'm using a couple of the arrows off there um, because sometimes I'll put a card and then it doesn't really make sense because I'm looking at it going well okay what does that mean and so then I'll go ahead and just kind of stick a little arrow pointing to the photo that it's kind of explaining and that little uh, sticker says love this uh, that's the um, email about my husband's being on the dean list, Dean's list and I loved those little umbrellas well one of the umbrellas was on the card and then the other umbrella was a uh, veneer no no I'm sorry not a veneer it was um, it was vellum sorry about the interruption there um, yeah so we got a little ziploc bag full of vellum shapes and there were just little stars and and umbrellas and I'm not really sure uh, where what kit those came from um, or what brand they are but they're really cute and now I'm just putting um, a little saying that says good times it's white so it shows up on photos that maybe have some color to them and then I think I find like a little <clears throat> excuse me a little uh, white heart uh, yes a little white heart to go no actually the white hearts already on there and a little black heart that says uh, love this beside that little saying that says what let your soul shine and now I'm trying to find a sticker or something to describe this photo and I end up finding one that says picture perfect because uh, it was perfect when I walked in the room and Polly was sitting like a person with her uh, front feet on the hassock and her butt on the couch um, it was pretty funny and then that one says this moment oh those were our stamps that we got in our kit this month and I really love them and this little corner stamp I thought is really good to kind of add some color or pop to your cards uh, that yellow I love the brilliant yellow but I just thought that putting that on the corner like that just kind of drew your eye to that card and then I thought to kind of balance it out I would do the same stamp on the corner on the lower right and I'm going to be using that stamp a lot I really like that and then another one of our stamps was a heart stamp so I'm gonna go ahead and put that on there too uh, and I'm just using um, black I don't know I just I wanted to add a little bit of black to the layout too which I always love as you know I always talk about loving black uh, and then we also have um, a sticker sheet uh, I think it's Ellie Studio and I love those too. I just love these kits. We just get so many different things. I apologize for my dog in the background. I'm trying to take care of her and keep her quiet today because the more she tries to run around and play, the more she um, coughs. It's really a bummer. She goes to a really, really nice kennel and it's kind of like a spa. I mean, they're just, they get one-on-one -on -one attention and um, it's just and she had her vaccine she had her kennel cough shot um, and everything but they say that they can still get kennel cough even if they've had their uh, vaccine and I think that the vaccine does make it so that they get a lesser you know they don't get as sick with the kennel cough but she was pretty much up at four o'clock this morning coughing um, <clears throat> so yeah poor thing I just feel bad for her and for us too because we had a really late flight um, the day before yesterday. We didn't get home until 4 in the morning um, from our vacation. So we're still trying to catch up on, on that. And then my husband was back to work today. So anyway, so this here, I'm just getting some mini alphas and um, just writing my husband's name with that teal collar. I found those teal collared alphas in my stash. And I actually just uh, organized my mini alphas in a booklet in I got the idea a long time ago I was watching a video and um, she just got a three ring binder with some I think mine I don't think mine are 8 by 11 they're kind of smaller than that I got at Staples but I bought um, some page protectors and then I just tucked in the um, the alphas according to color and now I just have one three, three ring binder and then I can go ahead and if I want red I can just look and, and grab the red out of it so 
That was a great idea. I think I'm just writing April on the top of this snowy picture, our snowstorm in April. And, oh, we got back from vacation on, was it Saturday? No, today's Saturday. Uh, it must have been Friday morning. And um, we have no snow left, so I'm really excited. We actually can see the lawn now, so it's awesome. So I'm just trying to find some twine to add to my layout here. I just kind of put it, wrap it around, and then um, into like a circle around my finger. And I, I think I like it because it adds some texture to my layout. And uh, I do that in a couple different spots, and then I just attach it with uh, my tiny attacher. And I just got this embroidery thread from Walmart and it comes in a big bag pretty cheap and it'll probably last me forever and it comes with two or three of each color in tons of different colors so that is my layout and I hope you guys enjoyed it I hope you're having a great day and I will see you guys soon take care bye